The procedures of any joint in injection first require the patient to be prepped in a gown. Then we go ahead and place the patient on a table and it's usually an x-ray table. We then prepare the site, whether it's a knee or a hip or a shoulder, ankle or elbow. We prep it by positioning the patient in the appropriate position and then we make sure the patient has no allergies. We then follow that by preparing the site to make it sterile. We clean the site with iodine or HibaCleanse depending on patient's allergies. We then very carefully place a very sterile sheet over the area and begin the actual procedure. The procedure usually entails administrating or injecting the patient with a numbing medication such as lidocaine. This helps the patient with pain. We inject the area superficially and then deeper. After the numbing medicine is injected into the patient, we wait. We wait a few minutes and then we introduce the needle. The needle will go into the actual joint, whether it's the shoulder, the elbow, the hip, or the knee or the ankle. Then we, once the needle is in the joint, we introduce a small amount of an iodine contrast and watch it on the fluoroscope to make sure that we are actually in the joint space. Once we confirm that we are in the joint space, then we introduce the gadolinium contrast for MRI, or if the patient cannot have an MRI, sometimes we only inject the iodine contrast. 